With your first News at 6 Sports, here's Lee Timmerman. They have the same last name, the same first initial, and they were born on the same day. Bowden and Bishop Duffield also have the same goal this week, to help Bowman County win the Boys B State Championship. JT Faribault has this week's Sports Spotlight. There's no need to rub your eyes. It's true. You may just be seeing double. Whether it's on the football field or on the basketball court, these twins from Bowman County are known for giving their opponents double the trouble. Bishop and Bowden Duffield, we, we have them on our team and we're very excited. We're very lucky to have them because it sure does make our jobs a lot easier. Bishop and Bowden Duffield have a connection that's second to none. After all, they've been together since before they were born. Good relationship. We hold, hold each other accountable. Uh, always competitive at practices to make each other better and just just overall uh, get better and we help each other do that. So we just know each other's play style and like we know where each other's at and we just have eye contact like uh, if he's cutting to the basket I like no and just give him a oop or give him a lob or something. It, it, it does help. We're, we're with each other all the time so I guess we're, we're close in that aspect and we just help each other get better. The relationship they've built on and off the court has only been to each other's benefit. If I didn't have my brother, I for sure would not be uh, good, good at as good as I am at sports right now. Because we push each other and we work hard together. So. Bishop and Bowden are everything Coach Stewart looks for in an athlete. They're boys that eat, sleep, and breathe basketball. They're coachable. You know, they, they want to do what's best for the team, they, and and they, they know when they're supposed to. To, to shoot it, be a little bit more selfish. They also know when they're supposed to pass and get their teammates involved. And so just by that coachability, you know, they, it, 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 it feeds well into their personalities too. They get to just roll the ball out and have fun. And that's, that's ultimately what we're all here for is to have fun. Bowman County is hoping to have fun this week at the Division B State Tournament. The Bulldogs open against our Redeemers tomorrow in the quarterfinals. With the spotlight on Bishop and Bowden Duffield, I'm JT Farabo reporting for your news leader. The Twins are also hoping to make it a 10 game winning streak in the first game tomorrow in Minot. EKM also plays in the afternoon while the Lobos have the first game in the night session. The Division A tournament is in Fargo. Three teams from Region 4 qualified, Beulah, Kildare and Shiloh. They will play in that order as well. Mark Wiedemeyer is in Bismarck for the Larks winter warm up. He has spent decades as a coach and advanced scout for a number of major league teams, plus he has managed international teams. Mark says his pro experience should help the college athletes who all hope to play professional baseball someday. They should be. I mean, that's the reason they should be playing summer college baseball. And I think uh, the opportunity for me to mentor these guys, I would hope they would be a receptive audience. They should be, you know. Uh, I mean, I've been in the game from the top down, and I've been there, all right? So I think it gives me somewhat of an advantage, at least an entree for them to be receptive, to ask questions, and to be open-minded about what I can teach them about the game of baseball. The Larks winter warm-up is going on right now in Mandan. The season opens on May 27th. Can't be soon enough. No. Nope. All right. We'll be right back after this.